deploy the flask app to uh, Heroku platform uh, just now I deployed this application uh, for that you need to have a github account like uh, I'm showing the GUI uh, that uh, how you can use the GUI to upload a uh, uh, your flask application first to create a repository and uh, add your all the files here like uh, let us assume that uh, which, with the flask app is currently in the working mode i'm not showing all the procedures like i'm just uh, giving the outline here uh, uh, let us assume that you have the working code here you need to add three more files those are the rock file and uh, runtime.txt and the requirement.txt runtime.txt contains what is the python version you are using follow this pattern uh, p uh, i think it's a case sensitive put it as a small and uh, this thing okay uh, and next thing is a uh, proc file like it will be helpful for uh, heroku to start it, it, you need you are telling that uh, from where you need to start the application that is uh, this is the file name which you are going to run like usually what do you do like uh, when you are running on the local machine local host uh, you will run this file and sometimes it might be changed to application.py you need to give that you need to remember that app.py and uh, and you should also remember this thing whatever the name you have given uh, put that here that's it in the proc file if it is of application.py and uh, app is equal to inside that you need you have the uh, line like app is called flask name what you need to do here is just open this web unicorn application colon app uh, in my case in the, it is both app so i just added uh, like this and uh, then you need to install the unicorn that is a must and should uh, what are the requirements like uh, your uh, flask app contains these are the requirements my flask app is having now right now and uh, this is the must like unicorn is the must mm, you should install you should uh, specify that here uh, because uh, it is a multi-threading one like you, you, if the, when you are running the flask on a local machine it won't like you don't test with them uh, like uh, multiple users so better to uh, not it, it, this is the must okay unicorn uh, mention this uh, requirement don't forget okay let us assume that you will have all these files here now uh, like you can create the proc file uh, here like uh, in the local machine and then just come here add the file upload the files that's it now all the requirements are satisfied now come to here uh, come here and create the new app uh, go to the dashboard uh, like go to dashboard there will be an option like create app now create the app now we are in our app like uh, come here and uh, connect your github account connect the github account it will like it will show some pop-up enter the password uh, make sure you know the password okay uh, after successful connection it will ask you to search for the repository like i created this uh, iot service provider you can just search here and uh, it will ask you to connect uh, just click on connect and then click on the automatic deploys like uh, make sure that uh, whenever you push the code to github repository it is working it will automatically like whenever it changes found it will automatically deploys and come here and if everything is fine that's you added the proc file runtime txt and all the requirements uh, like if you click the deploy branch it will automatically deploy now that's it that's it like uh, you can uh, like it will generate some you can view here uh, this is my site just now deploy thank you